Monday morning, 6 a.m., and I am about to hop in a car, go to the airport, and make a flight to Malaysia. American arrived with two very important things. One was the gin, which is actually Tanqueray 10, which I've never had before, and it's uh, particularly good. But this is from Yen, who went to India recently, and as you know, I love my flowery shirts, and she very kindly bought me five different materials here to make shirts from. So, thank you so much for that really love it look at these look at that isn't that beautiful we're going on a little adventure this is furlong's mystery cruise around the lamut area we are i've got two cameras to talk to here look you can see americans behind me more on him later. We are now in Lamut town centre and we are walking down the main street and there are lots and lots, I mentioned uh, anchovies, famous for anchovies around here and there are lots of shops selling big piles of dried anchovies. They're particularly tasty when you fry them up in a wok with a bit of oil and then you let them uh, cool down and they make a very nice snack to go with your beer. This is the old marina complex, so they've now built Marina Island, which is where we're based. And this became obsolete overnight, and it's now an abandoned complex. We've got a clubhouse, they still have pontoons, uh, looks like a bar here, but it's all empty. So it's a little bit of a ghost town now, and a, a real waste. We are prepping Esper for departure from the marina and heading offshore to some remote islands where uh, we're going to do a bit of exploring. So one of the things that we have to contend with is a current. There does seem to be a current here. We've also got a southeasterly wind. So we're going to go down to the second island first and have a look, see what the sea state is like. And if we don't feel comfortable with it, we're going to go come back up to the first island. And there's a little bay in the north where I think we may be able to anchor out the way of that current. As some of you know, we made some t-shirts for our Patreons and when we came to send them, uh, we went to the post office and they were so expensive we couldn't afford to send them out. So we got in touch with our Patreons and we came up with this idea that we'd keep the t-shirts and then give them to local people uh, just as a gesture of goodwill. And our Patreons were well up for the idea. So this is going to be our first experiment. There's a fishing boat that's just tied up next to us in this anchorage and we thought we'd uh, offer them some t-shirts, see what they say. Yes. Hey, 
Anyway, he said that he has plenty of fish on board and he's quite happy to give us a fish. So we'll let them pull the lines in. He's, uh, he's moored up for the night and uh, maybe we'll go back and pick up a fish and how about a barbecue? Well, no fish. <laughs> no fish. What's going on? We gave him some t-shirts. The idea was that, uh, well, we weren't trading t-shirts for fish, but they did say we're anchoring here for the night and um, yeah, we'll give you fish. Meanwhile, the other boat out there came alongside and actually wanted beer for fish and um, we said no because we thought we had fish in the bag, but it wasn't to be, never mind. So now Jamie's cooking up a dinner of potatoes and tofu and then we're going to enjoy a beautiful sunset here in this isolated anchorage.